all too often we have patients come in that tells us, you know, my primary care did my thyroid labs and they said, everything's normal. And my standard answer is normal's not optimal. I want to see your labs. Most of the time they've looked at a TSH, maybe a T4. They've not gone any deeper than that. And this is where I always encourage patients. If you're not getting that deep dive into things, or you're not getting someone that is willing to look at the thyroid in its entirety, find someone else. So normal lab values for your TSH, thyroid stimulating hormone, would be 0.5 to 4.5. Now this will vary a little bit from lab to lab, but that's the typical standard that we're going to see there. Optimal is going to be 0.5 to 1.5. For male or female, lab value goal is going to be the same. A normal free T4 level would be 0.8 to 1.8. An optimal free T4 is going to be over 1.2. A normal free T3 is going to be 2.3 to 4.2. For us, we want a free T3 to be over 3.5. So if you're sitting with a free T3 level of 2.3, you're not going to feel nearly as good as the person that's sitting at 4. 4.0. It's just not the same. That's wild. And, and it's like yeah. a, a little difference can make mm -hmm. all the difference. Huge difference. Yeah. And then we look at the T3 to reverse T3 ratio, which is where you take your T3 level and it's divided through a little bit of math by your reverse T3. And we want that ratio to be greater than 20 or depending on how you've converted your T3, it could also be greater than 0.2, but there's a ratio that we look at there. And if that ratio is lower than that, that tells us we have too much reverse T3. 